Hello. Um, I'm going to read some stuff off of my screen of my computer, so just ignore my uh, creepy darting eyes as they read what it is that I've written. Uh, hi there, my name is Roxy Bromley, and I'm an elementary teacher in Toronto, Canada. I teach STEM, which stands for Science, Technology, Engineering, and Math. Uh, students at my school come to me once a week. We work on awesome design projects. Students are given a challenge that they need to engineer a solution to. They use math and science to build something amazing, and we use technology to share what we've learned. In this video, you're going to see some of my school's grade 4 or 5 students designing and testing out their egg drop challenge devices. The two grade 4 or 5 classes that I teach are currently competing to win a pizza party, which is a huge deal when you're an elementary school student. The challenge that they've been given is that they need to protect a chicken egg as it plummets from the roof of our school down to the ground. I'm providing students with, with string, tape, nails and hammers, and hot glue guns and glue. The students need to provide a solution and some building materials. They should use building materials that are recycled or repurposed from their homes or their classrooms. Students have three weeks for the design and testing phase of this project. It'll be exciting to see how they progress. And now please check out what the grade four or five students did today in the lab. Woohoo! Let's uh, take a look at Dion. Oh my god! Dion the egg. Because of the tape! Because of the tape! <laughs> now, we need to, the problem is, we haven't seen Dion's bottom half. Um. So you need to open up the tape and see if our friend Dion has survived plummeting toward the earth. Oh, Dion. What happened to your egg? He died! He did die. How do you think you're going to improve this parachute plastic bottle design? I don't know. You don't I know? Don't what, do you, what do you think she should do? I think she should cushion it. Ah, or where? make this smaller. I make think. that smaller? What do you think? She should, uh, she should flip it onto its, like, so that it's facing up and down instead of on its side because when we did the experiment on stepping on the eggs, said that it was uh, the eggs are more stronger from top to bottom oh. instead of like, laying on its side and also the uh, I saw the pair it did fall like the parachute up fell down the oh so it the parachute didn't properly deploy that's a problem all right let's go get back to the drawing board I'm gonna eat the egg and I'm gonna wash my hands yeah wash your hands What have you designed here? So we put the sponge inside and like six sponges and then hot glue them together and then hot glue them again and put the string on it. So the string is to just add extra reinforcement until you've hot glue gunned your, your sponges. Yeah. And there's an egg in there, right? Yeah, yeah. Now why do you think this is going to be a successful design? Because I watched it on a video and it survived. Oh, so and you see? And it threw it up. And if you, if you drop it, like, the sponge is soft, so 
like it won't like if it pushes on the egg it won't break. Excellent. Okay. Let's see if it works. Oh, it doesn't work. What the heck? Okay, so uh what happened after you dropped it? How do you know? Let's open it up. Oh, that's a that's a sad egg. How are you going to improve your device? I'm going to put more softer layers. Okay. So more layers? Excellent. Back to the drawing board. So what, uh, how did you design your device? I you put tin foil. We have to double layer. This is a box, then you put cushioning in it, and then we put another box, and then we put cushioning in that, and then the egg, and then the cushioning, and then we take it. And then we take it. Now, why do you think this is going to be a successful design? Because of its double layer. Because we think, in, uh, we think the parachute will hold it prop, prop, properly and then it will. Yeah, and, and it, it will not slap. It will go down, down and its double layer will protect the egg. Okay, from so let's see what happens. Was your design successful? Yes. So the egg has no cracks, the egg survived? Yes. Excellent. Now, are you going to change your design? No. You're going to leave it the way it is? Yes. So we'll have to test it further. Good work, you guys.